Oh, my beautiful Scorpio friends, how are you? Welcome back to Sacred Knowledge Tarot. I am so happy and thankful to each and every one of you for being here with me today. So thank you so much, everyone. I'm going to pull three cards out of my tarot deck to see what message Spirit has for you. And at the end of this reading, Scorpio, I am going to be pulling an angel number card for you. So stay tuned for that as well. All right, we're starting here with the Page of Wands, everyone. I feel there is some good news coming in for you where you're going to feel inspired. There's some sort of a message coming, okay? And we've got the Knight of Pentacles as well. So I feel you're going to take this information and really move forward with it. That is exciting, my friends. Oh my goodness. And look at this, the Sun card. Good fortune and good things are coming into your life, my friend. So get ready for this. Oh my goodness. Okay, so... Give me a moment while I take a look at these cards and see what my intuition draws in, Scorpios. All right, Page of Wands. I do feel that some of you are really inspired. I feel that some of you may have found something online. You have watched a video of sorts. You may have had a conversation with somebody. Or maybe you had an intuitive download or a dream somewhere where it's, it's, it's uh, making you feel very inspired. This is the message I feel that spirit guides have brought to you in order for you to really start moving forward and follow your dream, follow your heart and do something that is going to really move you in the direction that you're wanting to go here. I do feel for a lot of you, you've been thinking about something for a long time and there has been a desire, something that has been kind of gnawing at you that you've wanted to do. This could be from your childhood, something that's kind of been sitting there and you're finally now inspired to follow that path, whatever this is for you. Now, I do see that there's new plans that you're kind of creating around this, whatever this is for you. You're excited. I feel that you have told people about this and you're asking for support on this new project or whatever this is maybe this is a new job for some of you right that you've been wanting for a long time or wanting to do and what you're doing now is really picking up skills around it because you heard something there's a message that came through this is what i'm feeling here okay scorpio and remember here with my readings you're either going to feel it subtly intensely or not at all so place it where it resonates for you and, you know, looking at all these cards here, my friends, I do feel that I'm getting good news coming in around this. There is some good news around this. Whether this is you sharing the good news with somebody and everyone getting excited or giving you a new message around it or um, coming in to help you around this, whatever this is, it's good news. It's really going to bring a lot of positivity into your life. Okay, and yes, I do see a lot of you picking up new skills around this. There's something new you're going to learn. And remember, YouTube, the internet, there is so much free information that we have access to. So look online. I do feel, and I've been saying this to a lot of the signs today, if you have children, young children, trying to tell you something, listen, because I do feel that spirit guides are trying to connect with you and communicate in different like unusual ways through children or through animals. I feel even animals are trying to connect or doing something. If you're noticing your cat or your dog doing something differently, try to take note to see what it is that they're trying, like what kind of a message you're getting through that. I don't know. I'm seeing animals. I'm seeing younger children. I'm seeing birds as well. Okay. So those are signs from the universe. That spirit guide's trying to connect with you. So I do feel there is a message coming through. And spirit guides are trying to connect with you. And it has to do with whatever inspiration that you're experiencing right now. Whatever that feeling is, that gut feeling to do something, it's around that, okay? So heighten your awareness here, my friends. Be aware of all the things that are around you, especially in this present moment. Take note of everything around you, the beauty of life, the beauty of the world, the beauty of your surroundings. Because I do feel there is going to be a message coming through here for some of you, okay? And whatever this is, whatever this inspiration is, I do feel that a lot of you are going to move forward with it. And with that being said, I feel that it's going to require a lot of patience on your end here, Scorpios. Okay? And 
whether it's an opportunity of sorts or whether this is you creating something, um, whether this is you moving towards a new career or a new project, whatever this is, I feel that you are going to go full throttle ahead with it because you're feeling inspired. That desire, that will is there. And for a lot of you, again, like I said in the beginning, it's something that you've been wanting to do for a very long time. And you're finally coming to a place in your life now that you're able to do it. So go ahead and make that happen for yourselves. Know that there are going to be challenges ahead of you. Because remember, the knight is going ahead into war. He has his shield. He has everything that he needs in order to come through successful. So know that you are well equipped here, my friends. And if you feel that you are not, start gaining those skills and that knowledge in order to really get through whatever challenges you are going to face as you go through them. And remember, every day we are faced with challenges. And this is going to be a new set of challenges, which I feel that you are very much up for. But know that you are fully equipped with your own life experiences as well, Scorpios, that you have gone through struggles and challenges in your own life that are learning experiences for you to come to this place now to follow this path. That's what you have been equipped for. You've been kind of picking up armor along the way throughout your life. All right. So I do feel for some of you that as you're going through this process, as you're going ahead, moving ahead in this forward movement, you are going to have people coming at you, okay? I'm seeing like people coming in different directions. Be very careful because sometimes when people see that you're moving along in a positive way, they want to kind of latch on. And we have to create healthy boundaries and arm ourselves from people, not actually like arm ourselves with armor arm. I mean, mentally and physically arm ourselves and be aware of some of the energy vampires and people that want our energy or to feed off of us because they're seeing us moving in a forward direction. Okay. I'm seeing that coming in the cards. And I do see, see that when you are moving forward to keep an eye on the types of people that come forward because some are meant to be on your team and others aren't. I don't know why that's coming into my head. But I do feel some of you are needing a team of people in order to build something. Whatever this is here, Scorpios. All right. And no, and I do feel that as well. Okay, so whatever message is coming in, I'm getting this now in my mind. Uh, Spirit guides are showing me this now. Whatever this message is, whatever this good news is, it might come in the form of finances. So maybe you've been wanting to invest in something or start something, but you've been seeking out finances. I do feel that someone's going to come in and present an offer to you, which you can take and move, sorry, move forward with, and it will prove to be very successful for you. So whether you've applied for a loan or if you've asked for fi financial support somewhere, I feel that is coming through here for some of you. So get ready to really uh, get ready for the ride of your life here, Scorpios. I do feel that there is going to be a lot of good coming in. It's going to have its own challenges, but I feel that you are going to face them head on. All right. And look at this. We have the sun card. There is good fortune promised to you. I feel this is giving you energy, this is giving you clarity, and because it's beside the Knight of Pentacles, this is amplifying the energy of movement in your life. So I feel that you are starting to do a lot of things in your life. So those of you that are creating a business, for, for example, with the Knight of Pentacles, I feel that you are right now in the midst of creating a website, you're putting together email stuff, like the whole planning process is in full swing right now. And it's being amplified. So I feel that a lot of you are getting a lot more work done than normal because you're feeling inspired and you have that energy of the sun. And because of this, I do feel that a lot of you are going to be very successful in your venture, this new venture, whatever this is for you, or in your new career, or in your new project, wherever this is. And remember, sometimes with the sun being the sun, we can get scorched. This woman has an umbrella. She's protecting herself from the heat. So be careful not to get overwhelmed or burnt out as you're going through this and take time to really enjoy yourself as you're going through this process and self-care is very important here. Don't exhaust yourself, okay? Because that is a real thing to come to exhaustion because you're so exciting, you're doing so many things that you drop from that energy.
So spread it wisely, my friends, and follow those dreams that you're wanting to follow, especially those of you since you were a child. That's what I'm getting here. For a lot of you, since you were young, you've had this dream, this vision of something specific. I feel this is what's coming into fruition for a lot of you. Okay, whatever this is, you can share in the comment section below if this is actually happening for you and what that is, because that is so interesting. I find it very fascinating. I do feel a lot of manifest manifestations are going to, going to come into fruition, that that manifestation is a seed, that something that you have been dreaming of has finally come in and now it's presented itself to you and now it's up to you to take care of it, nurture it and grow it. That is what I'm getting here in the sun card. The sun helps things to grow. So now's your time, my friend. Make your dreams happen here. I do feel that success is on your side. The universe is backing you and supporting you in all areas of your life. Call out on your spirit guides and ask them to support and guide you as well. And those of you that have friendships or good friends around, ask them for support, especially if you're working on a really big project. For, for example, building a cabin in the woods. Okay, so look at this. This is so exciting. I'm so happy for you, Scorpios. All right, I'm now going to pull a an angel card for you and see what we get here. You may have been seeing synchronicities and numbers or getting intuitive message or something. And you can use this also as an affirmation. So let's see what we get here for you. 555, five, five, I am optimistic. Look at that. Let me read this card to you here, Scorpios. A major shift is about to come into your life, into your life experience and change your path's direction. Be open and stay positive. Oh my God, I'm getting goosebumps. I do feel that's what's kind of coming in. I really do. And I feel that open, open your arms wide, embrace that energy, invite it in my friends and go for it. Go for anything that it is that you want to do, whatever you've been dreaming of, whatever it is that you've been desiring to do. Because I feel that that wish is going to come true. All right. So there you have it, my friends. That is your reading. If it resonates, please comment below. Hit that like button. And if you're brand new to my channel and you're enjoying my content, please consider subscribing. Other than that, I wanted to wish you all a beautiful day. And thank you so much for watching.